All right, good morning, guys. We are gonna be doing something a little bit different today. Um, I have a pack of gulp shrimp and I have a pack of DOA shrimp that I'm about to pull out in a second. What we're gonna be doing today is a lure comparison. I'm gonna throw for 30 minutes of each lure and then I'm gonna switch lures and throw it. We're gonna be throwing docks, mangroves, just about everything today that you would see on the uh, East Coast in Florida. But let's check out these lures and see what I'm gonna be throwing. So right here, this is the gulp shrimp. This is what I'm gonna be starting off second, so we're gonna do that second and then this is the uh, world famous DOA shrimp that everyone knows. Gulp shrimp are actually very, very scented. They're super strong smelling and DOA shrimp are, don't have any scent or anything. The way that I'm gonna compare these lures is I'm gonna throw them 30 minutes each. There's gonna be a point system for redfish, tarpon, snook, trout, and black drum and sheep's head. Those are all gonna be awarded two points for each lure and jacks and ladyfish are gonna be awarded one point. We're gonna compare these lures, we're gonna test them out. I'm gonna switch every 30 minutes and um, yeah, let's get right into it. All right, so we're starting off today with a DOA shrimp. I've honestly never thrown this in my time of like fishing like heavily. Maybe I threw it when I was like a kid or something, but we're gonna start off with this, toss it around and uh, hopefully we're gonna find some fish. All right, so it's 6.46 right now. So we're gonna do 7.15, I'm switching to the gulp shrimp. Oh, there's fish. What is it? Oh, first fish of the day. This is a two-pointer. See if I can get him in. Here he is. All right. All right, there we go. First fish of the day, and we got how much time left? We got 25 minutes left, so five minutes in, we got our first fish, and that is like a 15-inch, 12-inch snook. But it is a fish, so that's two points for the DOA shrimp. Toss him back, and we're gonna keep fishing. Let's go. Oh, there's a fish. Let's go. All right, so just a little dank, but it is a second fish for the uh, gold or not gold shrimp, DOA shrimp. Now come here. Ugh. All right, there he is. Second little dink of the day, but it is a snook, so another two pointer. So now let's see. The uh, DOA is at four points, if I'm not mistaken. All right, there he is. Just a little dink, but four points for the DOA shrimp, and we're gonna toss him back. Bye, buddy. All right. So that's four points, and let's see how much time we have left. We have 12 minutes left, so we're gonna keep throwing this guy. Ooh, there's a fish. What it is. Oh, okay. Mangrove snapper. I didn't say this, but we're gonna count it as one point because I would put their level of aggression equal with like a jack or a ladyfish. Okay, there is our baby, baby mangrove snapper. Just a little guy. Toss him back. All right, and we got five more minutes. So, trying to make a few casts in right here with the DOA. Okay, let's see what time it is. Seven, seven fifteen, right on the dot. Let's switch. So I'm just using a basic trout eye jig head with a red eye, and uh, let's see what color are these. New penny. All right, so these are three. These are three inch in new penny, and we're gonna drop it right on here. I believe this is a quarter ounce jig head. I'm gonna rig them up, and let's throw them. This is what I'm used to throwing. This is what I've always thrown as an artificial shrimp because of the super, super strong smell. And uh, let's give it a go. Gonna have to catch a few snook here. Ooh, ah. All right, missed a mangrove snapper under there. Let me go back in there for him. All right, it is actually eight o'clock right now. I made a pretty good run, but I'm gonna keep on the gulp shrimp right now and we're gonna give it another shot because I made a pretty big run in the middle of the uh, gulp shrimp's time, so we're gonna give it 15 more minutes. So at 8.15, we're gonna go ahead and switch back to the gulp shrimp. Something just splashed right there. Oh, I threw right into it. Oh, it's a ladyfish, what the? Dude, how did he get on this side of the dock? Oh my God. How am I gonna entangle this? Oh, come here, ladyfish. Oh my God. It was the worst tangled mess ever. All right, one point for the gulp shrimp, and I think we got about 10 minutes left. So this is a ladyfish and he's just a one pointer. Oh no, he's pooping, ew. All right, there's our ladyfish. Get rid of him. Whew. Ooh, slam this. Pulling out right under the dock there. 
All right, this is actually not a bad mangrove. So that is two points for the gulp shrimp. And I'm gonna check the clock here in a second. All right, there's our mangrove snapper. He's not, not a massive one, but two to five for the gulp shrimp, or two to five now. DOA shrimp in the lead. Toss him back. See you, buddy. Let's check the clock. Right now it is 8.13. We got two more minutes, so let's throw a few more casts on this dock. All right, time's up, two to five. We're gonna switch back to the DOA shrimp. Let's see what time it is. 8.50, all right, time to switch. Oh, there's a fish. What is it? Little tiny, tiny lady fish, but it's a point for the gulp shrimp, and looks like he knocked the gulp shrimp off, actually, so got to get another one. All right, there we go. Three to five for the gulp shrimp, and that is actually my third gulp shrimp I've used today, so I've only, I think I only have three left, so that's definitely going to factor into the comparison today, you know, how long they last and how durable they are. Three to five. All right, we got 22 more minutes. What is this? Oh, another lady fish. Oh my gosh. They're literally everywhere today. I usually never ever catch ladyfish and they're absolutely everywhere. Four to five and I actually see a nice red to my right. I think just took off. <sighs> All right, four to five and I actually just spooked a red while I was catching that ladyfish, so it kind of sucks. Okay, so unfortunately I gotta move a little bit. I'm not sure if this is gonna be the end of the video, but. Okay, so this looks pretty bad right here. I'm gonna go ahead and move farther away from this. We're gonna keep fishing, but um, we're gonna go right back to the gulp shrimp and when we start fishing and yeah, let's get away. All right, so we have successfully juked out the storm. Got some uh, sun actually coming out right here. Maybe, hopefully. And uh, I don't remember which one I was on. I was on gulp shrimp. All right, so we're going to DOA shrimp now. And it's still 5-4 between gulp shrimp and DOA shrimp. DOA ahead. And um, now we're going to throw some mangroves, change it up a little bit than, the, than you know, the different dock structure that we fished earlier. Um, it just rained a little bit ago. We're going to get right back to it, throwing the uh, DOA shrimp here. Ooh. There's a snook. Man, get out of there. Get out, get out, get out. Oh. I saw a big one come swimming out of the trees, and I was like, oh, a snook right there. And then I tossed it under, right, under there right where he went and felt a hard thump on this, and here we go. Oh. All right. There we go. That is... All right, there we go. DOA shrimp. And that's about... I don't know, maybe, I don't know, 16, 17 inch or so. And that is, I believe, 7-4. There you go, 7-4 for the DOA shrimp. It was just 5-4, that's a two-pointer, so now it's 7-4 for the DOA shrimp. And it's actually pulling through. It's catching a lot of fish today, and I haven't ever picked it up. I kind of I like it. Got him that time. What is it? Let's see. Tiny, tiny snook. But another two points for the freaking DOA shrimp, dude. I'm so surprised. Little guy, but it's fish. Can't complain. 9-4, I believe, and I think we got 15 minutes left, so 9-4. This thing's slaying the snook today. Snook after snook. It's the fourth one, I think, and it's on the same DOA shrimp, which is pretty good. The gulf shrimp, I've gone through like four of them, through just like mangrove snapper and ladyfish okay so i think it's time to switch over to the gulp shrimp but it was a really close one right there two reds just put their nose right up to the doa and then didn't really commit after that they kind of sniffed it and turned their head all right let's switch to the gulp 30 more minutes with the gulp there's a fish is that what i think it is yes it is let's go It's a little guy. <laughs> Two points for the goal. Nine seven. 
dude, I knew it. This wasn't the red I saw. The one I saw was like 22 or something. But we got our first red fish of the day and two points for a gulp shrimp. All right, seven to nine. Not a bad red fish, bright blue tail. And uh, yeah, I want to get a bigger one, but I think we, we definitely still got some time for the gulp shrimp. I'm gonna lay him back in. I think I found a little mangrove pond. Let's see. I don't feel like looking at the map. I kind of just feel like going back in here and looking. Let's see what's back here. Some sheep's heads. That's a good sign. Maybe there'll be some snook and tarpon back here. Oh, I think I found a little mangrove pond. Let's see if we can find some fish. There we go. There's a fish. Oh my god, is this what I think it is? It is. Oh my gosh. This is definitely a two-pointer for this, uh, I would give it a two-pointer. I've never caught one of these before. All right, so this is a pretty nice Kubera snapper. I'm pretty certain it's a Kubera. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm definitely going to give this a two-pointer for the gulp shrimp here. So we're at a eight, nine. That's a pretty cool fish to catch. I've never really, never, I don't believe I've ever caught one. Maybe I have. I don't think so, though. And uh, in this backwater pond I just pulled up on, it's just a little three foot, little three foot gap to get in through the mangroves, and we're in a nice little pond. We're gonna go ahead and just toss him back, though. Whew, I wasn't expecting that. All right, that was super cool. All right, let's go eight nine on the gulf, but these these lures are just so, so close. Hard to compare them. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and call it right there. Pretty productive day, actually. It was a, I think it was a decent comparison. But we pretty much got a lot of different species. So to finish off, DOA had nine points. The gulp had eight. The gulp I did get a few more ladyfish on, but you know, yeah, that's how it goes. DOA it got a lot of snook today. A, I mean a lot. I think I had four or five snook today. I don't, I'm not really sure. But I think the winner of today's comparison is the DOA shrimp. And I wasn't really expecting this because I've never really even picked them up. I kind of just look at them at the store and look right past them. But they literally sell them in every tackle shop everywhere, literally anywhere. And there, I guess there's a reason they've been around so long and they sell them everywhere and they never come off the shelf is because they literally work. That's simple as that. And I do think these baits are very similar. Um, the difference, the gulp is just a little bit smaller with a jig head, it sinks a lot faster. So it's definitely has, they do have their differences. They're not perfectly similar. The DOA sinks really slow and the gulp actually has a very strong scent. You guys decide, tell me in the comments, which one do you guys like using the gulp shrimp or the DOA shrimp? And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that video and I will see you guys in the next video.